So the pair of falcons, the pair of green falcons that we now have at the river's edge, one of our friends observed the, uh, the, the falcons near the uh, NDG park. Uh, first time I think was on an apartment building at uh, Sherbrooke and Girouard. And uh, after that, we started seeing them around the church and the people around the church also uh, reported seeing falcons. Well, in the next few weeks, you will see uh, what I just described as uh, relays at the nest. In other words, the male bringing food to, to the female who is spending most of her time on the, on the eggs. The only time she really comes out is when the uh, when fresh meat comes around and you know the, the, the male will take her place on the eggs. Uh, that will give her some time for you know, gymnastics, exercise, etc., etc. Uh, so three, four, maybe five times a day you'll see this type of scenario. It's difficult to tell uh, at which time this will occur, but uh, early in the morning, uh, midday, uh, you know, maybe 11 to 2 o'clock, and then uh, mid-afternoon and uh, early evening, you'll, you'll see this happening. After uh, the incubation period is usually 32 to 35 days, if uh, the eggs are fertile and if there are uh, hatchlings, then uh, they'll stay another 35 to 42 days in the nest. You might, depending on how far inside the, um, the roof the nest is, uh, you will uh, see some appearances every now and then from one or two or three, or if we're lucky, four babies. Uh, and eventually they'll be uh, grown enough, they will have uh, uh, enough uh, wing uh, strength. And uh, so, you, and, and eventually, if all goes well, uh, then you will see the parents starting to teach the young ones how to, how to uh, fly first, and eventually how to hunt, how to catch a prey in midair. And uh, so, you know, there's, uh, if this goes well, there'll be happy and uh, exciting days uh, to come.